hey guys and welcome back to another video um in today's video i'm going to be showing you how to make breadcrumbs without a processor and for that we're going to be using some old bread or some stale bread and we want to slice them into even pieces and then for this particular one i took off the crust and then put these slices in a pan or a tray and then just toast up the slices in the oven until they are really really dry Now depending on what color you want for your breadcrumbs, you can leave them a bit longer till they turn quite brown or you can just take them out once the bread is really dry and then you have a lighter or whiter color. So once you've got all that done and the bread slices are out of the oven, you want to leave them to cool a bit before you crush them up. Now you're probably wondering, so we don't have a food processor, what are we going to do? We're simply just going to use a rolling pin and we're going to put these slices into a rubber bag or if you have a ziplock you can put them in. And then just use the rolling pin to sort of bash them or beat them. You can also just gently roll them. If you feel like you're using too much force, you can just roll them around so you get fine pieces. And once you're done, you can just bottle them up or seal them in an airtight container put them in the freezer and they're good to go. And so anytime you need breadcrumbs, you need them really quickly as well, this is what you can do. A great alternative to a food processor. I hope that you enjoyed this short video and I hope that you've learned something today as well. And I will see you on the next one. Happy eating.